commentary by the Township Committee. Mr. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I have three items. Uh, number one, uh, November 7th is Election Day, and I would urge everybody, uh, all four of you here, plus the rest of us, to come out and vote. Um, it's important to vote. It's important to exercise that right, uh, irrespective of your affiliations and thought process. So I would say that. Uh, we have been uh, going to many houses, uh, checking on um, uh, status of voters and things like that, and found that the numbering system in the township is incredible. There are so many places where you'd say, gee, how do they get these numbers? And we're just very, very proud of the fact that, uh, you know, the chief, had, our fire chief has been so diligent in providing the houses with the numbers that are needed. And the last thing is uh, on the new uh, update of the iPhone 7, not the new 8, but the 7, they have put a, um, it's, it's not quite an app, but if you're driving, they shut off the ability to have messages come in to your phone. Now, unfortunately, it says on the bottom, I'm not driving, you can press it, and it would open up the situation. But I do think when the, when the eights come out, and I've heard some good news about that, I think we'll be very, very, very close to having the ability to have parents oversee the phones and keep people from texting while driving. I'll let you know more about that as it happens. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Deputy Mayor Johnson? Yes, just a couple things. Um, uh, again, congratulations to Father Lance. He is just a wonderful man and such an asset to the community. I'm so glad we were able to honor him in this way tonight. And uh, also, I just wanted to mention that last night we had just the most wonderful anniversary celebration. It's the 100-year anniversary of the Woodland Fire Company. And what a turnout. And we got to name a street, uh, Prendergast Way, after the man and his family who actually started the fire department in a barn a hundred years ago. So it was quite an event and just really worth being there, very, very moving. And if any of you, I, I, I think Patty, you, you might have been here, but um, yeah. it was great. Nice so night. we have such such a rich heritage in this in this township. When events like this come up, it's always worth going. Thank you, Mayor. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Mayor. Um, first of all, um, Lewis, best of luck to you, and uh, at some point in time we'll be uh, thanking you for your service to our country, and uh, that uh, definitely goes a long way, so thank you. Um, I also want to thank our police department, our fire department, and everybody who, who showed up here tonight to wish well the, uh, the officers who were uh, either sworn in and or promoted, as well as the swearing in, um, a new career firefighter. Um, you know, we're ranked in one of the safest towns um, in the state uh, for a reason. And we do have an, an exemplary uh, first response system. Um, so congratulations to all of those folks. Um, and, you know, what we as a township committee, we support everything that they do. Um, and uh, we'll have a little, little, little uh, display here tonight. Um, you know what, we, we support them, and uh, we're, we're going to make sure that everybody in this room was protected, and you just don't know. So uh, I want to thank the police officers for their professionalism in, uh, in handling that situation as well. Uh, that's all I have to say. Thank you. Thank you, Lewis. I echo Mr. Caffrey's comments. Good luck, and uh, thank you for your service to our country. Um, two, two items. Um, the Marsh Township Health Department uh, is having flu clinics. On Tuesday, October 24th, uh, from 1 to 3 p.m., and Friday, November 3rd, from 1 to 3 p.m., there's no appointment is necessary. Uh, this clinic is open to all residents of Mars Township and to children who attend school or child care in Mars Township. Uh, vaccine is free for all that have the traditional Medicare B, um, so and make sure you bring your Medicare card with you. Uh, private pay, those with Medicare HMOs, no insurance, private insurance, or Medicare B. The cost is $25 for the vaccine, or $40 for a high dose, which is available for those who are 65 and older. The location is here at the Mars Township Municipal Building. If you have any questions, if you don't have insurance and want to speak with our nurse, um, you may be eligible for a free flu vaccine. Uh, if you have any questions, please talk to our nurse, Kathy Whitehead. 
973-326-7392 or kwhitehead at marstwp.com. Uh, and phase one of our automated single stream recycling collection program is beginning during the week of November 13th. Um, you who are in phase one will receive your cart. All the carts will be delivered on the, uh, by November the 20th. And the carts are blue in color and specifically are for <coughs> recycling, not trash. The new system allows our residents to now place all recyclable materials, bottles, cans, cardboard, junk mail, magazines, and newspaper into one container to be left out for curbside collection. Place all the materials loosely in bags. Tying and bundling of the bags is no longer necessary. And please do not tie paper or cardboard. A complete list of the recyclables is available in your municipal calendar or on our website. There is no cost to our residents. Uh, there are display models of these carts at, here at our municipal building uh, or at the Department of Public Works at 6 Jane Way off West Hanover Avenue. The blue cart is for recycling only. If you have a 95 gallon can, you will get a 95 gallon can blue can. If you have a 65 gallon can, you will get a 65 gallon can. Uh, there is also a 35 gallon can for those that have the smaller, the smallest cans. Uh, your recycling collection day remains the same. So if your recycling is collected on Monday, your collection day remains on Monday. And if it's collected on Tuesday, it'll remain on Tuesday and so on and so forth. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact our Public Works Department, uh, publicworks at marstwp.com or call the office at 973-326-7398.